what is this day a quiet place <gasps> i love day one films oh. i've talked to, i've talked about it on this on this podcast many times so like you tell me a storyline day one oh i love day one all right You can't have a cat in here. It's a service cat. days. No more people. No more New York. No more nothing. Yes. Yes. I want to see that. I mean, Lupita, Jimon, Joseph Quinn, Alex Wolf, all of them, every single one of those actors. Yes. Have you enjoyed the 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 Quiet Place uh, series uh, before? Uh, I think um, Emily Blunt and what's my boy's name? Um, uh, Kaczynski. No, no, not Kaczynski. Yeah. Uh, John Kaczynski. Yeah. Kaczynski. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kaczynski. Yeah, yeah, John Kaczynski. Um, Jim. Uh, yeah, I know. Really, oh, God, yeah. that po- that poor man is gonna be chasing that name for the rest of the <laughs> uh, He, I, I think those two. I mean, I think they're both producers and directors. So on the film, um, I, I enjoyed the first and the second. So to see them go back to you know the prequel and how it all started, how it happened, because we never really got to see that. We kind of just understood there was some type of likely alien invasion or some someone freaking developed something in the lab that just like a virus. So we weren't really sure what happened. Yeah, we were like a year, one year in, I think, is when uh, uh, Quiet Place started off. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So to see this, to see them take it back and tell this story um, with a great cast, like you said, Lupita, I mean, she's just amazing. Um, I'm looking forward to it, man. And Joe Munhonsu, oh, yeah. love that man. That's oh, yeah. that's a man that's. I mean, I I love the the actors that are. I call him that guy. You know, like you may not know their name, but you see him in everything, and you know every time they're in that scene, you're like, oh, I'm gonna enjoy this scene because I love this guy. Like yeah. he's one of those guys. Like he eats up a scene, and I just love it. And also one thing I want him that I, I really appreciate and like in every role, damn near every role that he's been on, he has a really Changed or his accents per se, like it's him. Him, like, like some actors, you know, change their accent a little bit or to fit a certain character, but it just feels like him. First of all, he has good stage and all on camera presence. Oh, he does. But, but like he, like he stays true mm-hmm. to him as as himself while 
play that character and doing a really good job. So I'm like, even yeah, even if they're, I mean, because his his voice and accent, you're like, never change, like never change that perfect, like that baritone register he has, and that natural. I'm, just, I'm trying to remember where is he from off the top of my head. Yeah, it's Benin. Oh, Benin. Benin. Oh, okay. Benin. Oh, Benin. Sorry, Benin. That's why I've <laughs> Benin. I say with my <laughs> flat white accent. Sorry, Benin. Yes. I mean, just a beautiful register of just like everything you do, my friend. And he does it with such commitment. Yeah. 